What's going on guys, that's your boy Project I spent out bringing you another episode of Pokemon Empyrean. In the last episode, we went through the Trainer's Grove, got Protect, I battled all the Trainers in their Grove, so we went to the cave uh, that was uh, located west, I believe. And I uh, met with Blitz and Moira, Moira uh, to go to the... Uh, the what was it called? I don't remember what this place... Oh, actually, it's right there. Shawmunk Lake. Uh, sorry if it seems like I'm snuffling. I think, I, I think I'm, uh, my nose is blocked up because of the weather change. So, bear with me. Let me also put the mic a little closer. Okay. <clears throat> so, yeah, we went to Shawmunk Lake. And uh, Blitz uh, was unconscious, by knocked out by something. And we don't know what it is, but it was crazy. It was level five, but it was it was tanky as hell. And it was using fire punch, thunder punch, bone rush. Sounds like a Marowak now that I think about it, because Marowak can learn those type of moves, correct? Not sure. I know Marowak's signature move is bone rush. Um, Lucario's as well can use bone rush too. So it could be one of those two Pokemon. But let's continue with the story. <clears throat> hey guys, uh, if I find another Mudkip, I plan on catching it. But do you are you interested in me switching? Um, Mudkip for um, the horsey that I'm using. I don't generally use horsies or any of its evolution lines, so I thought it was could be interesting to use, considering that I oh I tend to always use a uh, Mudkip in Let's Plays. So if you think if if that sounds interesting to you, let me know. Oh, okay. Looks like back. Oh, a Swampert type. Okay, now, now I'm definitely interested. Oh. Okay, switch because this thing is Steel type. Uh, it looks defensive, so let's go to Aguilar. Action kill, right? Oh wait, I'm seven levels higher, so it might just do it. Oh, it might be sturdy. Okay, good. So it's exactly like a what you call it. Now, now I'm wondering what Honchkrow looks like. I'll catch it in a premier ball. Damn it. Glad Aguilar resists. Oh, okay. Well, that makes things even better. Alright, let's use a great ball. You're at 1 HP, you're paralyzed. This is a. Wow! That's the second time a great ball, uh, has made a Pokemon just pop out immediately. I wanted to use a special ball for you, but you're being a little difficult, so... Really? For some reason, Murkrows have, like, a terrible what you call it catchery. Wow. Okay. Wow. I am honestly shocked. I'm floored. You would think I was trying to catch a starter with how many Pokeballs I'm using on a 
one HP Murkrow that's paralyzed. Thank you. What should I name you? It has a hat and wings of steel. It can cut down forest trees with its feathers. Let's name you Titania. speak with that person. So let's backtrack real quick. Interesting. So in the place before I found a Venusaurite, here I found a Swampert type. considering wait wasn't she okay okay I guess I'm not supposed to meet her let's just make sure that I can't catch Mudkip using a fishing rod I mean, I doubt it, but let's just make sure. Let's see. Okay, never mind. said I've always used um, Swampert in Let's Plays. So having a using a different water type Pokemon is interesting. I generally don't use the same Pokemon over and over. Like, like for example I'm the type of guy who would use a Persian in Pokemon Reborn. <laughs> I, I've done that before. I've gotten far with it too. Technician Persian. Had it used, had it pick up as a um, meow. Managed to get a lot of items that way. And then as things got harder, gave it technician. And I got to like. I think the last person I used, uh, the last gym leader I used Persian on was Seal.
how I feel like getting self-destructed. Thank you. back there. Really? I mean, I don't think Kelly is slow by any... Are you... Are you... What? out of here. Okay, she just disappeared. Okay. Oh, is that thing gone? Finally, I can head home now. Oh, what's that there? Ah, oh, my pendant! It is a very precious amber pendant that was passed on to me. I see you're curious. Here, have a closer look. Uh... So, someone is knocking on the window. No, it can't be. We're on the fourth floor. Curlia! How did you get here? Oh, you can do that? I'm happy to see you too. Do you want to lie in the bed? Your hands are so cold. You shouldn't have done this for me. It, it's been a while, hasn't it? What is it? What? S someone's coming? Um, uh, you should hide under the bed. Oh, Willie, you're awake. Uncle! I have news, Willie. The good doctor said you could go home soon. Possibly today, so I brought you your Reuniclus costume. Th thank you so much, Uncle. I'm finally, going to get Blah. I'm finally going to get to travel around as a Pokemon trainer. Isn't that great, Kurt? I mean, yeah. Willie, I'm sorry. Huh? They said you won't be able to travel around on your own yet. I'm sure if we just wait a bit. I don't know. Or maybe if you find some friends to get along with you. Oh. I... I'm sorry. What the hell was that? Oh, okay. I think I know where I am now. Yep, we're back here. Okay, I'm guessing this is... They're now inside here. Nice joy. Oh, whoa. Okay. <laughs> so now it's not free. So where am I supposed to go? Nice, a Pokeball. Let's see, Poke Gear. Ah, Shama Tens on the right. Okay, so I'm heading in the right direction. Dorvir City is that way. Okay, and what's this? Aver Tracker. Oh, 
don't know what that's all about. Nice, found a super potion. Didn't even need to heal up. The Pokemon in this region don't have too much stuff in them. If you want stuff, go west. Osutra and Silen are the richest towns after all. The solar clock symbolizes the slow passage of time here in Shamuk. Everything is a little bit calmer here. All plan, no work makes Joey a happy boy. Hello, Sean Mike. We never have to go to school. Oh, wow, okay. Huh. This town is lovely. Huh. But the traitors that plague it. Disgrace. What an ungrateful bunch of whiny, smelly tree ninjas. They don't know how to enjoy nature. We didn't have all these things. But today... No, no. Everyone has fancy Pokeballs and their Game Boys or Pokemon. Pokemon. Even a Pokemon are an ice sort. What is that? An ice cream? I used to buy ice cream, but now it's a Pokemon. It's an endangered species. <laughs> Calm down, bro. Let me show you a piece of ice regarding the ap Apoplums right here, Gilbert. When your Pokemon consumes an Apoplum, you get an apple plum seed, which you can plant in Lumbee Slowly, like this one. Some apple plums sometimes bear different flavored fruit than the flavor you planted. I believe the normal apple plum can bear apple plum blue or apple plum yellow fruits. By successfully when planting these new flavors, you can get some pretty rare ones. That's all of the advice I gave you for now. Oh, so that's... Is that what the apple planter is all about? What's with the music change? I didn't steal anything. I'm gonna have to remember you. I'm gonna remember you. <laughs> it's locked. Coffee shot, menu. Coffee, $50. Juice, $50. Okay. Let me check out this place first. Don't you know it's rude to barge into other people's houses like that? Mmm, you're not wrong. <laughs> okay, that's locked. Pretty chill place, huh? This table's the ta this table next to us. I once saw a couple kissing. They must have been on a date or something. I wonder if I mean nothing. Huh. I'm an elite trainer. Elite trainers will pit rail. I had a rumor that there's something hidden in the back room in Sidler's gym. There's no way to go inside there though, as long as someone's there. Hiya! I'm trying hard not to break this wooden table in half. I mean, hiya. <laughs> it's here. What should I take? Coffee or juice? I can't decide. I'm having a juice. I don't like coffee. Welcome. Hello, welcome to the Shaman Cafe Shop. Oh, okay. So I, I can't I can't get anything. I thought it was gonna be like a healing item, but nope. Alright. Okay. 
Have you heard? Two Pokemon trainers stopped that berserk Pokemon. Even our guild had tr trouble stopping it. They must be something special. The Pokemon in it. Oh, okay. I already talked to you. with all the nurse joys. Did you know you could speak break pots? All you need is a hammer. If you missed your chance of getting one in Kalistan, you have a second chance in Strongbuck. What do you want, boy? In need of some, of some healing? Technology makes people obsolete. Did you know that? <laughs> when was the last time you visited a doctor? Don't lie to me. <laughs> That's uh, that nurse club over there is scary. I wouldn't go near it if I were you. Shall we check? Uh, shall we take a look at some of uh, our Pokemon? Right. See, yeah, he's he's in the box. Power, Nebula, Zer. I have so many Pokemon that I could potentially use. Trills, Braver, Donna, Titania. First of all, let's see what you are all about. Lonely Nature, which is uh, not the best, <laughs> but it's doable. Wow, okay. Um, Some interesting Pokemon in this game. Some interesting typings. Four specific Pokemon in this game. Alright, let's go here and check all these houses. Oh, excuse me for a second. <laughs> Sorry about that. I wanted to watch the TV, but there's nothing but boring cha news channels on a boring news on all channels. After the report recent happenings at the Shawmind Lake, the authorities have doubled the budget for the Pokemon Research Centers. Does the government overdoing it or so? Again, it's impossible that some individuals might be largely profiting from all of this. We have Dr. Tulsa on the line here. Dr. Tulsa, what is your opinion on this? Was this budget increase really necessary? We cannot come into a government movements at the time, but I think it is of utmost importance to prevent this sort of incident from happening again. In light of that, I believe the budget increase is justified. Those pe pesky Pokezoars are interfering with our business. We we'll have to do something about it. That's locked. What am I doing here? Right. I'm selling Slugmas from Flame Body. Do you want some? It's just $2,000 each. Yeah, sure, why not? Call it Numb. Because it's Numb Nexus's favorite mod. Nice to Pleasure doing business with you, Hawk. I left my fe female Jotian at the daycare. <laughs> Do you know what that means? I have loads of Eevees. I might even give give you one. Oh wow, Th that would be cool. Thank you. Welcome to the Pokezar. What do you got? Oh, Pokestar Super Potion? 
It has a 10% chance failure rate. What? Okay. I'll buy three. Apple farms. Oh, right. The apple farms. Oh, okay. Oh, hi, Shen. Glad you made it to Shawmuk. How do you like Shawmuk so far? It's quite a tranquil little town, isn't it? After that situation at the lake, it's important that you two take your time to relax and enjoy this randomly. Us three, you mean. We can't forget about Blitz. Oh yeah, how is he? How is Blitz doing? I was just about to invite you two to come see him. He's resting at my house. My wife is taking care of him. Yeah, let's go see Blitz. Shen, Blitz is awake. Oh jeez, where am I? What are you all staring at? Blitz, do you remember what happened at the lake? At the lake? Of course, I got my ass handed to me. That's what happened. Blitz, don't push yourself. You couldn't have possibly defeated that thing on your own. Me and Shen almost lost too, and we fought together against it. Hmm. You should have stuck to your friends. You're always stronger when you're with your friends. I don't need lectures. I've got to hit the gym. My Pokemon are getting rusty. Dare, you can stay here as long as you like. It's important that you rest properly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This all happened because I wasn't strong enough. So that's what I must do now. Get stronger. Just so you know, Shen, this doesn't mean you're better than me. No, no. I'll prove it to you. By the time you enter the gym, I'll be leaving it. Sayonara. Err, uh, we're sorry. Don't worry. I know he's thankful. He's just having trouble expressing it. He'll come about eventually. How's that, then? I guess you two are off to hit the gym, too? Yeah, that's what we're aiming for now. That's good. Blitz was right when he said he, he needs to get stronger. But even if you're the strongest trainer in the world, without any friends by your side, you might as well be the weakest. You should find a balance between these two sides. Then, dear. Neen, dear. Are you going back to Astura? Asutra? Yes, yes, soon. I've got a few errands to run and then I'm off. Shanamura, you two are big, fine Pokemon Rangers. I'm looking forward to meeting you again. Shen, I'm going ahead to get the second badge. Wish me luck. Hi, Shen, how are you doing? <laughs> uh. Cool. Oh, so that's her, their house. Cool. If you leave two Pokemon in the daycare that are in the same egg group, you might receive a mysterious egg from the daycare later. Yeah, well, I don't trust these daycares. Puff, puff. On the surface, they tell you that your Pokemon is fine and all, but behind the scenes, they're using your Pokemon in illegal underground Pokemon battles. Yes, sirree. You heard it from me first. <laughs> Alright, bruh. Bah! Don't pay attention to this guy. The real truth behind Pokemon daycares is that they swap your Pokemon with another one of its kind, but even though it's a uh, higher level, the, uh, its IVs are weaker. In short, they're illegally training Pokemon in order to get the ones with perfect IVs. You heard it for, from me first, pal. All right. Y'all need to chill. <laughs> So you're here to fight the gym? Watch out for Siler's Scyther. Very dangerous. Thanks for the tip. Oh lord, he's here again. 
Yo, son. You search for Shady, you find Shady. I got sweet deals, son. Wanna trade men food for my cadaver? Do I have a man food? I think I have a Mianfu. Do I have a Mianfu? Let me check to see if I have a Mianfu. Because a Kadabra, I'd be able to get an Alakazam easily. I mean, we're doing a trade after all. Let me see if I have a Mianfu. If I don't, then we'll just move on. I do not. Okay. Good to know. Let's go this way. Even as Poke Rangers participate in tournaments. Alright, the building here is the Shaw Monk Tournament Arena. Doesn't it look awesome? Let's check it out. What level? Uh. Ah, you come to train for the gym? Well, you come to the right place. Huh. This arena is pretty primitive compared to the one in Dor Dor River City, run by Battle Code. These monkeys here don't even know how to make a roof. <laughs> Chill. You don't need to call them monkeys. I lost again. Four times in a row. How can this be? My stone fist is in top shape. Before we read back, before we head back to the guild with you, we're gonna head up this tournament in Shaman. You said it, sister. This tournament will be a piece of cake. Hi, are there any open tournaments? Yes, there are. Which one would you like to? Okay, we got a four three twenty here. I'm sorry. It seems you don't have enough money to enter. Oh, really? Oh, right. I did buy a bunch of stuff. Well, we're at 33 minutes anyway, so um, I might just sell stuff at the Pokemon first, and then we'll end the episode, and uh, we'll, we might do the tournament in the next one. I'm pretty sure I have some stuff to sell. Tiny metal. I mean, tiny mushroom. We could sell. The, uh, no. Let's not sell that. No. <laughs> Anything else? sell these two potions. Let's see. save the game right here and I will see you guys in the next episode later